In order to understand the operation of the major components and subcomponents of an aircraft, it is important to understand basic aerodynamic concepts. This is going to be a quick overview, but don't worry, we will dive deeper into aerodynamics in a later video. Four aerodynamic forces act upon an aircraft during flight. These four forces are thrust, lift, weight, and drag. Thrust is the forward force produced by the engines and the propeller. It acts opposite to the force of drag. As a general rule, it is said to act parallel to the longitudinal axis of the aircraft. Drag is a rearward retarding force and is caused by disruption of airflow by the wings, fuselage, and other protruding objects on the airframe. Drag opposes thrust and acts rearward, parallel to the relative wind. Weight is the combined load of the airplane structure, the crew, fuel, and cargo or baggage. Weight pulls the airplane downward because of the force of gravity. Weight opposes lift and acts vertically downward through the airplane's center of gravity. Lift opposes the downward force of weight. Lift is produced by the aerodynamic effect of air acting on the wing. Lift acts perpendicular to the flight path through the wing's center of lift. An aircraft moves in three dimensions and is controlled by moving it about one or more of its three axes. The longitudinal or roll axis extends through the aircraft from nose to tail with a line passing through the center of gravity. The aircraft moves about the longitudinal axis when it banks left and right. The lateral or pitch axis extends laterally across the aircraft on a line through the wingtips, again passing through the center of gravity. The aircraft moves about the lateral axis when it pitches up or down. The vertical or yaw axis passes through the aircraft vertically, passing through the center of gravity. The aircraft moves about the vertical axis when the nose moves left and right. All control movements cause the aircraft to move around one or more of these axes, allowing for the control of the airplane in flight in all three dimensions. One of the most significant components of aircraft design is the center of gravity or CG. The CG is the specific point where the mass or weight of the aircraft may be said to center. More simply, it's a point around which if the aircraft was suspended or balanced, the aircraft would remain relatively level. The position of the CG of an aircraft determines the stability of the aircraft in flight. The effect of the center of gravity moving too far forward and aft may require excessive control input to maintain control of the aircraft. The aircraft's center of gravity is computed during initial design and construction and is further modified by the installation of equipment, cargo, passengers, and other factors loaded on the aircraft. 